here, but uh, <laughs> it's getting very popular. We're going to get to that in a moment. First, though, something a lot of people have probably been waiting for, a sequel to The Devil Wears Prada. It's finally in the works. My parents are probably the biggest fan of this song. Really? Yeah, so it's just hitting people of all, of all uh -huh. ages. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. Thanks, Brianna. <laughs> Uh, let's check in with Leslie Lopez. Hey. Lopez, what are you doing over there? You know, just seeing northbound. Now, reports are it's just blocking the center divider. I think we probably do have some lanes blocked off as well. It's at Harley Knox Boulevard, and we have a crash involving a motorcyclist. And so you can see it's moving very slowly through this area. You don't have a whole lot of alternates, so just make sure if that is your commute that you'll leave early and allow for some extra time. Advisories, but for the most part, we still have them through much of the Southland. So I'll show you on that map in just a moment where we will see some of the heat. Your sky is pretty much anywhere. 67 degrees over into Van Nuys, a nice mild. Getting rid of some of our heat advisories for the LA Basin, a little further north in some areas of Ventura County. But for the most part, we still have quite a few that are in place all the way through the end of this week, where we are going to continue on with that heat wave and the very hot triple digit temperatures with some pretty warm overnight lows. So if you are, especially in the deserts, we aren't seeing much relief at all there. It's about 89 degrees in Palm Springs already, 78 in Victorville, 81 over into Palmdale. Ridge of high pressure is not going to be changing much this week. So you can see it is still pretty strong. This is uh, your Tuesday. We go into Wednesday. We don't see much changing. Shifts a little bit out to the east, but not a whole lot. Then by Thursday, a little more so, it will start to break down a bit, and that will happen more as we head into Friday. So we will start to see by this weekend a little bit of relief. It's still going to stay very warm, but the other feature is going to be this low pressure that's going to be right off the coast. With that flow around a low pressure that goes counterclockwise, it's going to potentially spin up uh, from the southeast some of that monsoonal weather. And so you see it here on our map where we might see a chance of some thunderstorms or showers for our mountains or deserts. Very weak chance right now, but it is Friday. We should start to get a little cooler back down to some mid 80s and will continue to cool in the beginning of next week. So we, and then our temperatures will cool off a little bit as well. But right now it's about a 10 to 20 more as we head into the beginning of next week. So we still got to get through the rest of this one though, Les.